Once you've customized or created a design, you'll need to save it to an EMB for future use and export it for your sewing machine. I'm Linda Goodall and in this video we'll cover saving and exporting. EMB is your working file. This file retains all the colors and the most information. You'll want to always save to EMB and if you need to come back you will want to open the EMB to continue working. Stitch files on the other hand are your machine files. They only contain the information that the machine needs to stitch out your design. So they may not retain all your working information like stitch type, density, colors, etc. This is why you want to always save to EMB and always work and edit from your EMB file. More on that later. Here's a stitch file that I've opened and added lettering to. So it's composed of both hatch objects and my stitch file. I want to save it as an EMB so that I can edit in the future and that's done by clicking the Save button. Now this design has already been saved previously so if I wanted to do a Save As I would go to Output Design and choose Save Design As. I'll give it a name, we'll call it Pitter Patter 2 and I can click a format. Notice that all of these are various EMB formats different versions. I'm just going to leave it at the first one and I'll click Save. Now we need to export it for our sewing machine. In the Output Design toolbox I'll click Export Design and here I can choose my formats. Now since I previously saved as a PES it remembers that. If I want to save for a different machine, let's say I'm going to sew it on my multi-needle, I'll go down here and I'll pick Tajima and just click Save. Now notice this time it's going to My Machine Files folder. If you need to export for multiple machine formats or mass convert multiple designs for even one format, we can do that from the Manage Designs toolbox. Open the Manage Designs toolbox and we'll navigate to the folder we want to work with Let's say I want to convert this bottom row. So I'll select that one and shift click there and I'll choose convert selected designs. Tell it what formats I want. And I previously had VP3, HUS, EXP, and DST. And if I need to add to that list or change it, I just click on the little boxes. And we'll click convert. And that's just how fast it is. The main point to understand is that save is used for your EMB file or your working files, whereas export is used for your stitching files.